Heligoland is a nursery grounds for the grey seal. I'm visiting the North Sea archipelago, where hundreds of seal pups are born and raised every year. There are only few places where you can get as close to grey seals as here on Heligoland. And they are much cuter than I thought, but also much more dangerous. After a two-hour ferry ride, I reached Germany's only island in the high seas. Helgoland was once a hideout for pirates before becoming a popular tourist destination in the 19th century. But I haven't come to visit the famous sandstone sea stack known as the Lange Anna. I'm headed for Badedüne, a smaller isle next to the main island. In the winter there are fewer tourists, but many more seals. I'm here for them. Sometimes there are so many animals that ranger Ute Pausch must block off the beach for a while. This gives the seals some peace and quiet, but mainly it's to protect the humans. Because while they may look cute, these are Germany's largest predators living in the wild. From this special path through the dunes we can observe the seals and see why they've come. From November to January is mating season and the time when mothers give birth. Als Wurfplatz ist es so attraktiv, weil das Sturmflut sicher ist. Und das ist ganz, ganz wichtig für die ja, Auswahl eines Wurfplatzes. Die jungen Kegelrappen sind ja erstmal darauf angewiesen, dass sie mindestens drei bis vier Wochen an Land liegen können. Und das zählt. From up close, I can observe how mothers suckle their young. After two or three weeks, the cow leaves her pup on its own. From then on, it has to fend for itself. Obwohl sie alle relativ gleich aussehen, ähm, gibt es Ängstliche, gibt es ähm, ja, welche, die gleich auf Krawall gebürstet sind, die immer unfreundlich sind. Es gibt welche, die gucken sich alles in Ruhe an. Also vollkommen unterschiedliche Charaktere. After a few weeks, the pups make their first attempts at swimming. But only after they've molten or shed their first fur coat. Their cuddly white lanugo doesn't offer them enough protection in the water. Over 650 pups were born here this winter, more than ever before. And just two weeks after giving birth, the cows are ready to mate again. At this time, the males are even more aggressive. The bulls, which weigh up to 300 kilos, fight for the cow's favor. I witnessed that right on the beach. I feel safer by the ranger's side. Der größere ist auf jeden Fall ein junger Bulle. Ja, leider ist er gerade dabei, ein Jungtier zu begatten zu wollen. Die wirken niedlich, aber sie sie sind es nicht. <laughs> Now I know why we have to stay 30 meters away from them. Also, ich meine, die beißen dann nee, oder die wie? beißen, ja. Also, ich würde sagen, so so ein Bein von unserer Sorte kann da einfach durchgebissen werden. Ehrlich? Ja. Once they've raised their young and mated again, the seals gradually leave Helgoland. Then there are only a few left until next winter. Seeing so many grey seals in the wild is really impressive. Especially the little babies, they are really, really cute. But when you get so close to them, you realize that they are really, really dangerous predators. And that's why I prefer to watch them from the safe distance. But to satisfy my urge to pet one, I've borrowed this stuffed toy from my daughter. Definitely the smarter alternative. <laughs> 